In the book of Exodus chapter 2 verse 12, Exodus chapter 2 verse 12, the Bible says, And he looked this way and that way, and when he saw that there was no man, he slew the Egyptians and hid him in the sand. In the book of Jeremiah chapter 5 verse 22, Jeremiah chapter 5 verse 22, the Bible says, Fear ye not me, saith the Lord, will ye not tremble at my presence, which have placed the sand for the bound of the sea by a perpetual decree that it cannot pass it, and though the waves thereof toss themselves, yet can they not prevail? Though they roar, yet can they not pass over it? Close your eyes, my beloved brethren, and shout this prayer upon like a wooden lion. Say, every strange sand walking against my destiny, cast fire and die in the name of Jesus. Every strange sand walking against my destiny, cast fire and die, cast fire and die. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You're welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV, a TV channel dedicated for dreams, interpretations, and warfare prayers. I am Evangelist Joshua Ureke, broadcasting from Lagos, Nigeria. Today's topic is sprinkling of sand or dust through prayers, part two. Sprinkling of sand or dust through prayers, part two. By the grace of God, I have shared the prayers of speaking the sound of those true prayers, part one, in my previous broadcast. Today we are going at part two. I pray may the Lord use the dust to blind and to spoil all the plans of your enemies against you in Jesus' name. Did you know that the dust or sand has the power to listen and obey your commands? In Exodus chapter 8, verse 16 to 17, no doubt, dust is connected to a man's nature. Genesis chapter 2 verse 7. Without the dust, there is no creation of man. All men return to dust. Job chapter 34 verse 15. The dust can attract blessing. The dust can send a curse. The dust can break any spiritual chain, troubling your progress. The dust, however, can be used to bury or hide things. In the book of Exodus chapter 2 verse 12. In Genesis chapter 22 verse 17. Genesis chapter 22 verse 17. The sand prayers can be used to possess our blessings and to have dominion on earth. We can use the sand for back to sender prayers. If you want to prosper and succeed and take possession of your goodness, you need the sand prayers. According to Genesis chapter 32 verse 12, the sand prayer is very, very important, especially if you feel your progress is being hindered or you are finding it difficult to take full possession of things on the earth. The devil understand the mystery behind the dust. And that is why he has been using it to torment, to destroy, and to attack the destiny of many people today. That's why you see some people today, either they pray with the sand, or you, they use the sand against someone's destiny. Someone can use the dust to blind a person. Someone can use the dust to rain causes on person's destiny. Someone can use the dust to block and spoil the destiny of a man. If you look at the way many people are perishing today, it's as a result of someone using the dust against them. They say, now, today, the dust shall swallow you. And they have laid that curse on the sand. And they sprinkle that sand back to the head. And that, as long as that person step on that head, the glory of that person will be troubled. I pray for you today. Any power that has poured sand on the ground in order to subdue your glory, I pray, let that evil plan backfire in Jesus' name. For example, when the devil or someone wants to wicked a person, he can easily apply the sand with other charms to capture, to transfer, to exchange, or to put serious affliction or blockage in someone's life. Some put charms on the ground, some put dust on your office seat, some blow dust on your clothes in the clothesline, the public clothesline of your house, some put dust on your shoes. The moment you step on it, the moment you wear that shoe, then some terrible things will begin to happen to you. The Bible says, the heart of a man is terribly wicked who can know it all. In this video, by the grace of God, we are going to continue from the part one of sprinkling of sand, sprinkling of sand prayers. And by the grace of God, we are going to achieve three things through the sand prayers. You are going to break the course of the wicked, you are going to spoil the plans of the enemy against you, and you are going to retrieve back whatever the sand has collected from you. There are many people today, the moment they step their feet in a particular house, in a coarse house, once they carry that leg to their own house, bad luck, you 
will continue to experience they will continue to experience bad luck as a result of their feet by the grace of god we are going to pray on sam today and the lord almighty will retrieve or will paralyze everything that the enemy has programmed on the sand against your destiny in jesus name we pray amen if you have a business in your working life after the prayers sprinkle the sand around your business environment in order to subdue and paralyze all their witchcraft powers against your business growth the same thing applies to your house your office your village the way out to participate in these prayers you must surrender your life to christ repent and confess your sin remove your hands from evil cover yourself with the blood of jesus instruction you can take this type of prayers at any time of the day but night prayers have proven to be very very effective can you read the following bible verses number chapter 23 verse 23 psalm 34 verse 21 you are going to hold the sand any type of sand it could be your sand of your village the sand of your business the sand of your office the sand of your house any type of sand whether there's sand in your place or not so far there's this little dust hold it and use it to pray because these prayers are very very powerful in fact, if care is not taken, it will start operating immediately. Prayer point number one. Say, as I'm holding the sand, I command it to listen and obey to my commands. In the name of Jesus. Say, as I'm holding the sand, I command it to listen and obey to my commands. In the name of Jesus. You the sand, I command you to listen and obey to my commands. I command you to listen and obey to my commands. I command you to listen and obey to my commands. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number two. Say, as I'm holding this sand, any man or woman that is hindering my progress, may this sand fight them in the name of Jesus. Hold that, don't hold that sand firmly in your hands. As I'm holding this sand, any man or woman that is hindering my progress, may this sand fight them. Just like by the order of Moses, may this dust fight them. May this sand fight them. May this dust fight them. May this sand fight them. May this dust fight them. Begin to open your mouth and pray. Begin to open your mouth and pray. What you want God to do with this sand? What you want God to do against your enemy with this sand? Begin to command it to begin to command it to prayer. Begin to command that sand to fight on your behalf. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Prayer number three. Say, as I'm holding this sand, I decree that anything evil has been blown into my life. I blown it back to them. In the name of Jesus, you demonstrate it by blowing the sand away from your hands. Say, as I'm holding this sand, I decree that anything the evil or witches has blown into my life, blown into my marriage, blown into my finances. As I blow this sand, I blow all the problem back to my enemies. I blow it back to them. 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 All the evil attack fire against me. I blow it. I blow it back to them. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Prayer number four. Say, as I'm holding this sand, I decree any charm the enemy has poured on the ground to paralyze my destiny. As I pour this sand on the ground. It shall be neutralized by fire in the name of Jesus. As I'm holding this sand, I decree any charm the enemy has poured on the ground to paralyze my destiny. As I pour the sand on the ground, it shall be neutralized by fire. 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 Open your mouth and pray. You that woman, you're not praying. Open your mouth. You that man, you're not praying. Open your mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer number five. Say, as I'm holding this sand, as I release this dust back to the earth. Every of my goodness that the earth has swallowed shall begin to come back to me. Come back to me. Come back to me. In the name of Jesus, as I'm holding this sand, as I release this dust back to the earth, every of my goodness that has been trapped by the earth, begin to come back to me. Begin to come back to me. Begin to come back to me. Demonstrate it with your hands. Begin to come back to me. Begin to come back to me. In the name of Jesus, as I'm holding this sand, as I release this dust back to the earth, every of my goodness that the earth has swallowed, I begin to come back to me in Jesus' name. Prayer point number six. As I'm holding this sand and as I release it back to the earth, any evil arrow fired into my life shall go back to the senders in the name of Jesus. As I'm holding this sand and as I release it back to the earth, any evil arrow fired into my life go back to the senders. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number seven. Say, as I'm holding this sand, and as I release it back to the head, I decree anyone that has hand in my problems, they shall die in the name of Jesus. As I'm holding this sand, and as I release this dust or this sand back to the head, I decree anyone that has hand in my problems shall begin to die, shall begin to die, shall begin to die, shall begin to die. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer number eight. 
Say, as I hold this sand, and as I release it back to the earth, let the charms of the wicked against me begin to die by fire. In the name of Jesus, as I hold this sand, and as I release it back to the earth, let the charms of the wicked against me begin to die by fire. Die by fire. Die by fire. As I hold this sand, and as I release it back to the earth, let the charms of the wicked against my life, against my destiny, against my glory, begin to die by fire. Die by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer number nine. Say, you this sand, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to paralyze every evil leg that is walking about for my sake. In the name of Jesus, you this sand, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to paralyze every evil leg that is walking about for my sake. In the name of Jesus, you this sand, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to paralyze every evil leg that is walking about for my sake. Paralyze there by fire. Paralyze there by fire. Paralyze there by fire. Paralyze there by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer number 10. Say, as I sprinkle this dust back to the head, anywhere evil have gathered against me, let the power of God begin to scatter them unto dissolution. In the name of Jesus, as I sprinkle this dust, anywhere evil have gathered against me, against my life, against my project, against my plans, let the power of God begin to scatter them unto dissolution. Scatter them unto dissolution. Scatter them unto dissolution. Open your mouth and pray. Scatter them unto the solution. Scatter them unto the solution. Scatter them unto the solution. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer number 11. Say, you this sand, begin to wipe away any curses stored on my feet in the name of Jesus. You this sand, begin to wipe away any curses, any bad luck, any poverty stored under my feet in the name of Jesus. You this sand, begin to wipe away any curses, any loss, any bad luck store under my feet begin to wipe them away 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 in jesus name we pray amen prayer point number 12 shout this prayer point loud and clear say you this sand i command you to favor my life and destiny from now on in the name of jesus you this sand i command you to favor my life and my destiny from now on in the name of jesus you this sand i command you to favor my life and my destiny from now on begin to open your mouth and pray begin to open your mouth and pray in jesus name we pray amen prayer number 13 say as i hold this sand and as i release it back to the earth anyone that is wishing for my untimely death may the earth swallow them in the name of jesus as i hold this sand and as i release it back to the earth anyone that is wishing for my untimely death may this dust swallow them May this sand swallow them. May this dust swallow them. May this dust swallow them. May this sand swallow them. Swallow them. Swallow them. Swallow them. Swallow them. Anywhere they step their feet on, as long as they are on the on the earth, the earth shall swallow them. All those that are wishing for my untimely death, death will find them. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number 14, the last prayer point. Say, you wicked powers, pack it the sand of my business or the sand from my doorpost to attack me. May your evil backfire in the name of Jesus. You will get powers. Pack the sand of my business or the sand from my doorpost to attack me. May your evil backfire. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I pray the Lord Almighty will use these sand prayers to break any any anything that the enemies have programmed in your life in Jesus' name. I have taken these prayers and these prayers have done so much deliverance for me many years ago. So I have to retrieve these prayers from my archive. So I say these prayers must be a blessing to millions of people across the world. Take these prayers if you feel that you are threatened in your environment, you are threatened in your house, you feel that you are not safe, you feel that you are you are being attacked, take the sound of your of that house. Or you feel that you are about to you know, rent a new apartment, take the sound of that house and begin to pray. And you begin to see dreams revelations and vision after that prayers and may the lord give you that victory you have been expecting in jesus name we pray amen if this podcast has blessed you share to your friends and family once again this is evangelist joshua from lagos